Hello, this is Deborah from Golden Bee Tarot and Reiki. Welcome to the August 10th edition of Tarot Tuesday. This month we're working with the True Heart Intuitive Tarot by Rachel True. Close your eyes and turn your attention inward. Take a deep breath in through your nose, hold for a count of four, then slowly release the breath. When you feel calm and centered, open your eyes and connect with the cards. Choose the one you feel most drawn to, or perhaps two cards for deeper wisdom. Now that you've chosen your card, let's take a look at the reveal. Card number one, Nine of Swords. Anxiety is riding high this week, causing sleepless nights, excessive worries, and difficulty concentrating. If you've been dealing with heavy burdens and tough situations, you may find yourself at a breaking point, overwhelmed by the anxiety. The Nine of Swords is calling attention to whatever fears you have been faced with. It's sending a message that you can no longer keep your distress under wraps as it's taking its toll on you. Don't wait any longer to reach out for help. Talking things over with someone you trust will give you the peace of mind you so desperately need. Card number two. Ten of Swords reversed. A significant ending arrives this week, but instead of it being abrupt and painful, this is a more gentle release from the situation. Most likely, you'd already seen the handwriting on the wall, so this finish does not come as a surprise to you. Nevertheless, there are still loose ends to tie up, and you will probably still mourn what is passing. Give yourself the time to properly grieve for what has been lost. This process helps you to arrive at a place of acceptance and understanding. It will ultimately give you the clarity you need to move forward and embrace a new beginning. Card number three. Seven of Pentacles reversed. Your patience is at an all-time low, and you're no longer content to sit on the sidelines and wait for your schemes and projects to reach their full maturity. You want to move ahead and push the circumstances to your desired conclusion but you need to slow down and ask yourself if it's wise to rush ahead without fully thinking your plans through. What may seem like a sure thing could just as easily fizzle out if you choose to skip over important steps in your rush to completion. Rethink your priorities, do your due diligence, and you will find your success. Thank you so much for joining me. I'll see you next week.